Hey, welcome back to another episode of Tech Tip Tuesday. Today, we're going to learn about how to do a split screen on your iPads. Uh, it can be an iPad Pro, it can be a regular iPad, as long as it's not the iPad mini second generation or before, then you can definitely do the split screen. Let's take a look. It's actually quite easy, but not all the apps are able to do split screen. So not every app is compatible with this feature right here, but all native Apple apps, usually they will support it. So this is what I would do usually. I will have my favorite apps moved to the dock because that's how you can call out the uh, split screen feature. You have to have the app moved to the dock. Okay, so I will open up the Keynote app. Let's say I am preparing for a presentation and I want to capture some pictures from the internet. Uh, of course, like if it's for public use, then you shouldn't do it. But this is just for an example. I can swipe up from the very bottom just by a little bit, not too much. If I swipe up too much, it will call out the multitask screen or close the app completely. So let me do it one more time. I will swipe up from the very bottom of my screen on the iPad. It will call out the dock itself only, and I will tap and hold on to the Safari browser. I can move it to the left or to the right. So it's completely up to you. I like to have my uh, research resource on the left-hand side. So I'll move it to the left-hand side of my iPad and you will see that Keynote get pushed to one side of the screen and it will open up a space for Safari. And then I'll let go. It will open up a window for Safari browser. And let's say I have some really cute kitty picture here and I want to move one of them to my keynote presentation. All I need to do is to tap and hold on to that picture and it will become a floating picture. I can drag it. You can see that I have a plus sign already. When it gets to the top of my slideshow, I can just let go and it will just pull the picture to my keynote. That's the power of using split screen on your iPad. And if you want to adjust the window size of those two apps that you have open, all you need to do is to drag this bar left and right and you can adjust the size. Some apps, they don't allow you to have this tiny window size and that's just the way that it is. Let's say if you want to close both apps by swiping from the bottom and when you open up either one of those apps again, you will see the same split screen again until you do this gesture to close one of the apps. It's pretty easy, right? Thank you for watching Tech Tip Tuesday. If you want more contents like this, subscribe to my channel. If you like this video, click the like button and share it with your friends and family. Enjoy your tech and I'll see you next time.